Hi everybody. Continuing the mock-up of the elevators. So, in this video, we will be attaching the outer rib structure to both of the elevator mock-ups. After we remove the hinge, of course. And I apparently decided to do a lot of the work off camera. So while I'm fiddling around with this, let me just talk real quick about storage. Oh wait, here I am. Yep, getting ready to click this in. So, one of the things that you'll deal with when you're creating an airplane is, you know, I'm creating an airplane. I've got airplane parts. You know, they're not small. That horizontal stabilizer is damn near, you know, eight, nine feet across. Uh, these things aren't small, as you can see. And where are you supposed to put them? Yes, as you can tell, I'm working inside of a large hangar. I, and if you look above me, you can see on top of just a crappy shelving system, I have both my uh, vertical stabilizer and my rudder just sitting up there. Finding places to put all these parts uh, is, is, uh, is a challenge if you don't prepare correctly. I mean, there's a giant workbench behind me, but you must remember this is a working hangar that uh, my flying club uses for all of our uh, fleet's uh, club repairs, all the plane's repairs. I'm here by their grace and must remember that uh, I've got to keep everything kind of out of the way. And right around this time, uh, a couple of weeks after this, I got sick. Uh, you know, I, I had pneumonia. I was down for a week. Actually, two weeks, really. And I wound up having to have these elevators sitting in basically the state that you see them now, completely mocked up, Clecos everywhere. Uh sitting next to each other taking up the entire workbench. I mean, these things aren't small, so please, if you're going to build an airplane, plan ahead. As soon as I'm done with any part of these elevators where I can uh, have a moment, I'm building uh, a cradle for both the uh, vertical stabilizer and for the rudder. Now, in a previous video, you had seen me uh, make some room. Actually, no, you haven't seen me do that. Well, what you will be seeing is that uh, the horizontal stabilizer, which you might notice you don't see anymore, is actually hidden around the corner up on a shelf. We have some nice long shelves around the back side of our big T-hanger there, and uh, thankfully the uh, horizontal stabilizer and its cradle fits back there very simply. I'm going to actually confiscate the rest of that shelf to put both uh, the uh, vertical stabilizer, the rudder, and both of these elevators. So, storage is very important uh, because everything not only needs to be put away, but it needs to be safe. Uh, which also <laughs> reminds me I'm going to actually have to earthquake proof this somehow. I'm going to have to basically chain the cradles to the wall and make sure everything's wrapped in What's that said? Bubble. Yeah, bubble wrap. So, Anyway, sorry for the boring video. Just uh, prepping and building and everything else. So I'll see you in the next one.